Okay, I remember to hit record this time. Uh, let's continue. Alright, what do we have? A reading. Search for the relics. We need lumber and scrap. We need crabs. Okay. What? Uh, stuck. Both the crop pot ability with LB and plane with the X. They catch things over time, but need repairing every so often. Okay. They need to go in particular spots. drop them off like where I would go on my way home. Oh, that's the only one I have. Okay. All right. Uh, remembering my buttons. Remembering my buttons. There we go. We need more lumber than scraps. Scraps take up a lot of space. Uh, looks like we have some over here. Oops. Uh. Uh, that is a gold ring. Not what I need. Okay. Do I have the right rod for this? No. Cloth. Okay, that's useful. That's something I need. Uh, let's do this. Okay. There. Any more? It doesn't look like it. Uh, go home. Because I don't want to be caught out here in the middle of the night. That is a... Uh, How you get paranoid in this game, apparently. And I don't want to know what that does. Ah, it's happening. Oh. I don't want to know. Nope. Nope. <laughs> okay, let's sleep. Sleep, 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 please. We need to dredge more stuff. Ooh. 
Ooh, crab. Don't mind if I do. Looks like more dredgeable stuff over here, maybe? I still need metal scrap. That looks like scrap. Ooh. Okay. I can do that. And I find one more piece of wood, please. Ooh, something I can catch. That I probably don't have a space for, never mind. Alright, moving on. What the heck is that? The slag and slab of rock juts from this water, bearing crude symbols of carved fish. At its base, a rough shape has been cut his little way. Do I need to fill it with fish? Uh, gross. Fish. Ooh. Something. All that's left of the boat is an old husk. You pull a little closer. Look inside. Nice! Research part? Yes, please. Let's go home. Or... Uh, maybe not. Maybe we go to the place. I don't know. The stone hums quietly, sending ripples to the air around it. Faint shapes dance upon its surface, vanishing before your eyes can focus on them. Place your hand on the stone? Cold stand does not respond to your touch. Okay. That's good. I think. <laughs> uh. Oh. We're approaching the witching hour, I think. What is this? I do not have the space for that, <laughs> but we'll come back here later. Mm, no. No. What do I get for it? Uh, okay. What? Oh no! What? 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 No! What? What? Huh? Okay. Well, we found out. Uh, we found out what happens. Okay, uh, noted.
That's upsetting. Existentially speaking. Oh, more planks. Okay. Uh, to rearrange this a little bit. That's fine. Okay, so now I have enough parts to do that one quest. How far is that? Steel point? Just north? I mean, how bad could it be? Material pile. Okay. Where the builder wants you to put stuff. Delivered all the necessary materials. You should let the builder know. I'm gonna sleep. I'm gonna not fuck with that. fish here? No. Ooh. What do I do with these? Can I sell them? For money? Nope. Okay. I might have another crab. Yeah, I can see it bubbling. I have another crab. Wait. He's kind of jiggly. Alright, there we go. If you're wondering how to store two sharks, that's how you do it. Take it from a professional shark storage guy. Ooh. Is this what I needed? Eh. Well, I'm a professional shark storage guy. Maybe not a uh, professional crab storage guy. Okay, that's, oh, that's unfortunate. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Well, let's... Uh, 
I'll just discard a shark. That's fine. All right. Builder, you've done it. Well, no sense in wasting time. Let's get moving. Okay, never mind. Uh, yeah, one second. <laughs> yes. There we go. These will do. As you get some use out of that old pot. You can always buy more here, or repair your damaged ones at the shipyard. One final request for you. As you've seen, some fish around here can develop odd deformities. What do you think happens to a person that eats the flesh of one of those mutants? They go mad? Well, perhaps. But I want to know for sure. Bring me a mutant fish, any will do. Just keep this between the two of us. Uh... Who do I sell this to? Maybe that's what the builder is for? Let's sleep first. darkness does to me. Okay. Let us go. So I need to go north. I hate this cough. I wonder what the builder does. All right. Uh, give me a short while to get things built here. You're welcome back anytime. Oh, sure. Thank you. All right, let's go home. I'm gonna use these research points. Maybe I want to pick up the crab pot? I'm not sure. Let's fish so I can at least sell some stuff. Uh, yeah. 
let's go home. Research, research, flexible. Ooh, thank you. All right, <laughs> this is exactly what I needed. Check pursuits. Okay, I need one weird fish. I also need to dredge that thing that we saw. Let's do that. the dredging thing. Almost there. Oh, what's this? This pile of debris. Clearing this will take some strong explosives. Okay. Noted. There it is. Can I make it back in time? Oh my god. Uh oh. The key. Okay. One of the things I'm looking for, I understand. How far am I away from home? Not that hard. Not that far. Uh, but I need to get there within the next four hours. come back for this. I'm sorry. Almost family. Hello. Oh, I don't like the music. It's going okay so far. How about you? I think I drop off the key. Right, let's see. Pursuits. Return it to the collector. Yeah, alright. Okay. I 
may be able to fish some on the way back. But I want to get this out of my inventory first. Uh, this is Dredge. It, you kind of, you shipwreck one night, and, uh, they ask you to fish. And there's a lot of, like, spooky stuff going on. But mostly you're catching fish and completing requests for people. You're dealing with a lot of, uh, mysterious happenstances. Where's the lock? It seems the pieces we're looking for have traveled further than I anticipated. Much further, I suspect. Uh, yeah, I would say pretty spooky. <laughs> yes. In that case, allow me to aid your travels. Oh? Huh? Okay. Other old speed at a price. My intuition tells me that the current may have carried some debris to the southeast towards Gale Cliffs. Make that your priority. Mark a location on your map where you can begin your search. Uh, yeah. Uh, it's not quite what I was expecting, but I don't mind it. Uh, the words you read from that book. What did they do to me? The book holds power from the deep. I merely extended its power towards you. Is there one in particular you wish to know about? Haste. The words of haste are instant and cruel. Cool. Uh, they will impart a terrible speed to your vessel. Be warned, however. Ah, okay. It damages your engines. Uh, how long have you lived here? Quite some time. I used to be a fisherman, as was my father before. But two de decades ago, I took up residence here. I needed to focus on other endeavors. I found that this island has a certain strength to it. Those dark basalt columns stretching downwards into the deep. Okay. You know who owned these relics? Yes. Who? He looks at you. For a moment, a look of something like regret flashes in his eyes. An old friend. Okay. Oh, wait, I have trinkets, don't I? The traitor in Little Morrow. Okay. Alright. So I need to go. Okay. I see. So I'm guessing each of the things that I find give me a new power. Nice. I mean, I'd rather not gonna ask me to. I see. You don't want to use it for too long, but it doesn't immediately hurt you, I guess? That'll be nice. My controller is vibrating. Uh, I don't know what that was. Hello, is everything okay? Do you know of any shipwrecks around here? Oh yes, you see, my only son was lost at sea some years ago. He's still out there somewhere, in one of those wrecks, all alone in the cold dark water. This man is clearly trying his hardest to remain composed, but tremors grief rack his body. I was wondering, I noticed that you have some dredging equipment installed on your vessel. If you're able to retrieve any of his belongings from the wreck, I think he'd feel more at peace if his mementos were with me. He warns a bronze belt buckle, especially engraved. I'd recognize it anywhere. If there's any... If there's a chance you could find it, I'd be in your debt. Okay. Strange occurrences. I don't get up a lot anymore, but I don't think... I don't see much of what goes on. But I do remember the old mayor in his final days. What an awful sight it was. Uh, screaming and throwing things into the sea. Throw it back, he would cry, over and over. 
begging anyone who would listen, howling it to the wind. These days, I almost feel like I understand. Uh, okay. Alright, crater. You enter a brightly lit shop. It's packed with antiques, the shelves full of jewelry and other baubles. An old man peers at you over silver spectacles. Hello? Is that... No, I don't believe we've met. Forgive me, my eyes aren't what they used to be. I specialize in antiques and jewelry. I'll purchase any special trinkets you happen to have. Uh, yes. We have... That and that. Nice. Uh, for better or worse, I'm curious about what we heard earlier. It sounded like it came from over here. I don't see anything unusual. Not very valuable fish, but all right. I'm done fishing. Let's go home. <laughs> I don't want to be out any later. Mm. Gonna stress me out. You stay out too late. Other boats start to come for you, but they're um, they're like giant angler fish. Okay. The lighthouse keeper emerges from the dark forest that flanks the town. She walks towards the dock with a confused look on her face. Oh, it's you. Who are you expecting? Your engine, it sounds like... I'm sorry, I must took it for an a vessel of an old friend. Dejected, she turns and walks back towards the lighthouse. Uh, there we go. Sweet. Yeah. Can I use any of my cloth here? Yes. Net spaces. Uh, rod spaces. Okay. Yeah, we'll need to do this eventually. Yeah, basically, Giselle. Also, hello. Everything submitted. Let's leave. A little morrow. Ah, no worries. Hope the dishes went well. Thank you for being here. I really could use upgrades. Uh, Hmm. Let's look for the belt buckle. That looks like dredgeable stuff. Yeah. I need. Uh, like that. Okay. Well, 
That's one upgrade done, I think. Maybe. Or nearly done, at least. This right here, I think. Yeah, that sounds right. Okay. Hey. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, 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 my God. Wow. Oh. Don't let's see your skies. Uh, I have not, but I can definitely check them out. If you can DM me those names, then I'll be able to look into them later. Oh, I need to go home. I need to go home. I need to go home. I might have screwed myself here. I think I'm fine. Oh. About the buck belt buckle. Yes. This is this is his. Oh, thank you. Bless you. You returned him to me. Please take this. I have not any money to pay you, but this might hold some value. A research point. Yes, it does. Thank you. Goodbye. And I would like to sell that. Alright, let's sleep. And then we can go back and... Oh, actually, I can research here. I need volcanic. I don't. I have not encountered volcanic yet. I don't know if that's worth it. Here we go. I need that unusual fish. I need to... Let's go ahead and pick this up. Space. Okay, let's finish the wood here. Need a scrap. And. Go. Let's put the. Storage. Okay, and now. Oh, wait. Let's look at the shipwright. Uh, <laughs> at her actual store. We should be selling... There we go. Improved. There we go. That's what I need. Oh, I don't have the money for this. Oh, I do. Never mind. The Victorian Gothic roguelike exploration and survival games where London made some kind of netherworld deal and was transported miles beneath the Earth's surface on the shores of the Undersea. A massive body of water, completely devoid- Okay, that sounds rad as hell. I mean, I'm getting speed from this anyway, so I guess I'll keep it.
Oh, look at that speed. Finally. All right. Gale Cliffs, here I come. I think. Can I make it all the way over there? I don't know. <laughs> That's a long way. Only one way to find out. Oh. Does not respond to your touch. This must be something for later. Can I? I don't know if I can make it all the way over there. That is a long distance to go. Well, first thing that happens is I get reset, right? Oh! Hi there! What is that? Okay, with boosting I was able to make it all the way out. Please let me sleep here. What is it? Do you need help with anything? I've been trying to prepare a special meal for my partner, but I've been having some issues. Around here we consider aged hunger eels to be a particular delicacy. You may say they're rotting, but they're delicious if prepared correctly. What the hell? Normally we bury them in the ground and allow them to mature, but our dog keeps digging them up and eating them. I can't raise the subject without spoiling the surprise. Yeah, okay. Uh, in Sunless Sea, you captain a boat, top down, hire crew, and run cargo, freight, or exploration missions. One once a, uh, on a map made up of tiles that shift in every time you start a new game. Completely go insane, cannibalize your crew, and leave a will for your descendants. We'll captain the boat in your stead. You can also gain an upgrade to transform the boat into a submarine, which has a whole new level of exploration. It's really spooky and cool. Interesting. Very cool. Uh, where can I catch an eel? They can be tricky to find. I'm told they inhabit the holes and burrows within cliffs themselves. I imagine they've been fished out around the edges, though you may be have to venture into the passageways of cliffs to find them. They mentioned that they only come out at night. Oh god. Yes, I believe they hide during the day. Good luck. Um, what can you tell me about the cliffs? Many years ago, the cliffs used to have be a haven for smugglers and pirates. Legends tell of two pirate lords who used Gale Cliffs as their hideout. Supposedly, Supposedly, they got into some disagreement, and a huge battle was fought around the south of the cliffs. There certainly are a large number of wrecks in that area. Both sides were completely destroyed, their treasure hoards left abandoned and unclaimed to this day. I dare say they'd be worth a lot if anyone knew where to find them. Hmm. Do you know of any of the, old, of the odd characters around these parts? Mm. Have you heard of the tale of Macron? There's an old way of whaler from these parts. As the whales got more scarce, the crews spent longer and longer at sea trying to find them. Magrin, it seems, wasn't cut out for this. He formed an unnatural attachment to a scroll he found on one of those trips. He says the scroll told him how to become immortal by eating mutated fish. People started calling him Magrin the Fisherman. The Fishman. One day, the town awoke to find that all the boats, nets, and lines had been slashed in the night, and old Magrin was nowhere to be found, nor has he been since. Uh, been seen since. Where can I sell my fish? 
We catch our fish ourselves here, so we don't have much need for buying any. There's a merchant that travels around. She's usually anchored across the bay. She buys and sells almost anything. And she does repairs, too. Okay. What is it? Many shipwrecks around here. The real wrecks around here is the settlement in Gale Cliffs. My brother ditched us and moved on over to those cliffs years ago. I suspect he's regretting his decision now. The devil. Have you heard any, about any strange things in the area? Time, time ago, just after the last whale was brought in, there was a sudden exodus from Gale Cliffs. Dozens of ships sailed past, packed up and hurrying away north as fast as they could. They were waving and shouting something at us from their boats, but we couldn't make it out. Never did see or hear of them since. Uh... Tell me about Ingfell. Ingfell used to be a whaling town. Emphasis on the used to be. We would go out, bring in a carcass, and then the rest of the town would get to work. But the whales got scarce some 20 years ago. And now look at us. Barely scraping by for our new candle. Okay. Let's sleep. Uh, so... There is something I could... There it is. Oh. What the heck? I don't know how this works. Oh, weird. Manifest. Okay. Let's get this to the to the guy. We've been needing a uh, fucked up fish. Is the wind pushing it against me? Or am I imagining that? Also, why are there red lights underneath the water? Mm. I'm cause spooky. I guess you're right. It is spooky. Also, hello, rat. Water. Country road. I'm staying at home. Alright, here we go. I'm fine. Right. I am enjoying. I like the spooky vibes. Hello. Use your fucked up fish. The fishmonger takes the aberrated fish from you. He clutches it close to his chest, wringing his hands around its slimy body. Yes, it should do nicely. 
Here's what the fish is worth. I might you take these two. They're of no use to me. Okay. Hmm? You hear that? It sounds like the faintest whispering. You listen. Silence. In the stillness of the room, the fishmonger's hands begin to tremble. His face grows in anguish. Please, tell me what you need and leave. I must deal with this creature quickly now. Okay. You don't need to tell me twice. Goodbye. The fishmonger's door slams behind you. You hear the heavy scraping of a metal bar landing across it. Uh, okay. Crab pots. A fishing crab pot. Hardy crab pot. Large crab pot. Okay. Uh, ooh. Oh, damn. All right. Mangrove and coastal. Honestly, I think I'm going to shoot for just getting this one, right? Because then it just covers all my bases. I don't think I can use those anyways because I don't have enough... Uh, Bots. What's the speed I get from this? 14.7? Yeah. Uh, no. Okay. Let's just fish for a little bit, honestly. Fish for relics. Deliver a rotting conger eel. Right. Spine, cellar basin, twisted strand. Alright. Oh, I forgot to go to bed. That would be bad. Oopsie. Uh, let's check out the fishmonger. Barred from the inside. Uh, okay. I'm not gonna worry about it. I'm certain nothing will come of this. Alright. I would like to fish up that weird red thing. Is it? What is this? If I have a goal in mind, I should just do that. Are you the spooky red thing? Yes, you are. Alright. I can't do it. Whatever. It's abyssal. I see. I would like to not fuck with that. Okay, so I need to get some eels and then just let them rot in my f <laughs> my boat for a bit. I'm sure that's not risky at all. Ooh. I mean, I'll take a new fish.
Yeah, I've played Splatoon. I know what a salmon is. Let's uh, go to the trader, huh? I see, I see, I see, I see, I see. You mind if I uh, join you? Hello. Ahoy there. You're a new face. A fisherman, I take it? Perfect. Well, we should get along and like a house on fire. Ha ha. I'm a traveler and a merchant, all rolled into one. If you have any fish to sell, I take them on board and sell them at the next town I come across. Likewise, I haul a smart car small cargo of equipment between places. You're welcome to peruse the stock and see if there's anything you that takes your fancy. Come and see me when you're ready to trade. He's cute. Alright. Fish market. On this side of the pontoon, I'll buy any fish you want to sell. I also keep a stock of crab pots. Alright, let's sell all the fish. Say, have you met the photographer? You stopped by my pontoon a little while ago. He's loaded up with a fancy camera. Oh, fancy camera equipment to take pictures of all the wildlife. Besides wistfully. Wish I had my own camera. Wouldn't it be nice to be able to talk him in everything you do? You never forget anything. Anyway. She said she was setting up on a small island to the south of the Maros. If you're in the area, maybe you should check on her. Okay. Uh, okay. Can't really... Mm, yeah, I don't have... I don't have money for that. Oh, okay. Mm. Redox stuff. Alright. Uh, I would go to bed, but honestly, uh, I need to be up at night. So, oh, let me DM. Let me check. That's uh, just Giselle. All right. Thank you, Giselle. I will check on those later. But it does sound rad as rad as hell. Need help with anything? Assistance from an angler? Um, absolutely. I've been trying to collect records of where each species of fish is located. I figured out most of them on my travels so far, but there are a few I haven't been able to track down. I can you share some info? Sure, I can help. The fish I have left tracked down are oarfish, gulper eel, goliath, tigerfish, and col- uh, Come on, man. Colacanth? Alright. I know a little about each piece already, so maybe I can point you in the right direction. Mm. The oarfish I know uh, exists very deep underwater. Uh, it has a long and fragile body. I suspect they'll live in a reasonably deep but calm water. Maybe the shelter of gale cliffs would suit them. Then we have the culprit eels. I know that culprit eels live at the deepest depths imaginable. You have to get some specialist gear to catch one of those. Goliath tigerfish. These guys are legitimately scary. They hunt in murky, swampy waters using the shade of trees as cover. And cola cans. Actually, I have no idea where the cola cans might be. They have a primordial feel to them, don't you think? Uh, yeah. Uh. <laughs> what do you know about the Gale Cliffs? Well, there's Ingfell, just across the bay, where there, where, which is a dreary little whaling town. The folks there have are always in need of something, which keeps me in business. Uh. Residents are always talking about the cliffs. Most seem afraid. Frankly, I'm not sure why they stay. Occasionally, I hear rumblings from deep from within the rocks. I don't hang around there for long. Uh, are you always out on the water? Yeah, always. I like to keep moving along. The merchanting is secondary to the traveling, really. I'm more of a merchanting traveler. I get to see a lot of places, which is nice. I also get to meet a lot of people, which is only sometimes nice. Uh, these strange things out at sea. Strange things? Plenty. But I try not to dwell on them. You could go crazy, you know? Ha! 
But hey, if you're seeing strange things, maybe you're not seeing them the right way. Maybe they're not so strange after all. Or perhaps they are, and they're incredibly dangerous. Better not risk it. <laughs> uh, thanks. Okay. Uh, bye. I'm gonna do something dangerous now. Nice knowing you. What is this about? An old man emerges from one of the nearby broken buildings and hobbles towards you. Oh, ah, greetings. Don't get me to visit you around here. What is it that you need? This place doesn't seem safe. I, I've been stubbornly holding out here for quite some time, truth be told. I've been reconsidering my position lately. I've been happy here for so long. My wife and I had such a beautiful life until the collapse. Now I'm all alone and cut off by land and sea. Left only with these trembling rocks and slides. I could help you move to Ingfell. It's not that simple. My brother would never. You see, I used to live in Ingfell with my brother. He was a whaler back in the day. Things were bad. We fought a lot. Mostly about how our parents' inherent inheritance should be divided. We were in the prime foolishness of our youth. When my wife and I decided to move here. I took the family crest stole it from him. Now, after all this time, I can't return without it. Where is it? That's where the problem lies. After the collapse, that creature, it dragged debris from the houses down into its wretched burrows. The crest went down with it. It's a lost cause, I know. But if you were to find it, it's a large whalebone crest. It would mean the world to me. Look for it. Thank you, but please be careful. Hey, okay, man. Do you know where I could clear the debris around here? How I could clear the debris? You probably need some explosives to shift those rocks. My brother at Ingfell used to make explosives. The whaling operations, you see, nasty stuff. But with the whales all gone, I can't imagine he's still in business. Okay. Shipwrecks. Someone that used to live here kept their ship moored at the base of the cliff until it was struck by some falling rocks sunk to the bottom. They were devastated at the loss. We all were. It was a beautiful boat decorated with all manner of memorabilia from their travels. At low tide, I can still see what's left of the masthead poking out of the, through the waves. Uh, and what's happening to these cliffs? They're being consumed from the core by that baitful, that hateful serpent. Have you seen it? Nobody believed me. Not until it started devouring our foundations, opening up chasms beneath our homes. It was nightmarish. Walking in the night to the sound waking in the night to the sound of a creature slithering somewhere underneath. It seems to have turned its attention elsewhere, but not before it took everything from me. Uh tell me more about it. It's been burrowing the tunnels through the base of the cliff. You can see the gigantic holes it leaves just below the surface. As it forces its way out, it often causes rock falls. So if you plan on going in there, keep an ear out. Did it catch sight of you? Well, you should be able to outrun it. Quite slow, provided you can navigate the passageways. What else do you need to know? Or want to know? Nothing. I'll be gone now. I have one more to get. Ah, yes. Thank you, Giselle. Okay. Uh, let's undock and do our foolish thing here. Yes, thank you. Ooh, okay, there's the rat. I mean, not the rat. Okay, okay. But I need to fish. But I can't fish anymore, can I? I can't. I can't. Whew. Wait, this isn't what I need. Uh... 
is a foolish mistake. Made only by foolish fools. They're foolish. Uh, oh! Ouchie, ouchie! Oofy! I want to go to bed. Good night. Maybe I'm just leaving. Fucking squish. Hey, uh, traveling merchant. Do you have, um... Intelligence that I lack? In a... Non-metaphorical way? really pretty. A wreckfish. Research part for free, just for me. Don't mind if I do. I'm right, gonna sell that fish, and I'm gonna go over to the guy to talk to him about explosives, I guess. Okay, and then research. There we go. And dock. Alright. I don't like the music. Why is it so scary? Mm. Hello, whaler. Where'd you use to make explosives? I, I did. Sometimes the carcasses needed breaking up. It wasn't the most efficient, the most pleasant, but I got the job done. I'm thinking about getting back into it. I might be able to rustle up something strong enough to clear those debris piles in the cliffs. <laughs> have a good lurk. I'd have a use for your explosives like that. Alright, I'll think on it some more, but I make no promises. Okay. Yeah. It's not very useful. Okay, let's look for eels, I guess. Oh, dredging. Yes, please. Okay, what was that? What is that? What is that? What is that? What? What is that? 
Hello, Prowler. Oh, thank God, my progress from the other location is saved. Okay, that's one down. I'm gonna... I'm gonna... Uh... I'm gonna sleep. Stream's been good. We were playing some Moon Glow earlier, and now we're playing Dredge. Mmm, I prefer to not get hit by that. Balloons. I love the balloons. What's that? Arch Heath. Ow. Oh, I didn't need this though. Oh, I need to fish it up quickly. Fish it up quickly, please. No, no, no. Oh, there's still stuff in there. Unfortunate. The explosives in order to like get those heals. Oh, well, <sighs> the rockfish, not what I'm looking for. That sounded like it was behind me. Hmm. Okay. Dry dock. storage there oh oh it's it's cloud storage all right good that's what I need uh, I need another repair I know I know I know I'm really good at this oh what can I do about the maybe I'll go back to the guy with the explosives has he thought long and hard about it? Hello, Mr. Explosive Man. Can I buy some explosives from you? Uh... 
Uh, I see. You really use those to progress the story. Maybe I'll go back to his brother and say he'll consider it? I need explosives for it. Let's do, let's do. Ooh. Stonefish, not rockfish. A little different. Alright, I'm gonna go sell those, I guess. And use the wood. Oh, you know what? There's one size fish for over here, right? No, not those. Oh boy. Uh nope. Not what I'm looking for. Let's uh not be near that. Oh. I suppose I could set down my crab pots. I just had the one, but needs repair. Never mind. Oh, sweet. Okay. Let's sleep. Just fish today. I need the money. Never mind. <laughs> I guess not. <laughs> oh god. No. this. Ah. Nice! Did I rearrange these a little bit to open up room for at least one more? Mm. Not quite. Well, I can get one more. Sell. Hmm. 
Nice. Is there a back way? Let's sleep. And then we'll find out. I think the only way to make the explosives is maybe to find the emblem. Which means I should be able to get the emblem without blowing anything up. That's at least what it makes sense to me. Research part. That's scrap. More? Am I gonna have enough room for the emblem? I don't, I don't want to risk it. Let's go back and use it, I guess. How big are these fish? Are these the stonefish? Yes. All right. Yeah, I don't have room for that. research. I've finished both of the rods now. Sweet. And I need the versatile rod. some of that in storage. Yeah. Decent headway already. Alright. Need four planks and refined metal. I think I've seen a refined metal, but I haven't actually been able to get to it. I'm gonna put this on a quick BRB. So, BRB. Uh, I can get my cursor out. There we go.
Okay, we are back. I'm gonna go a little bit longer. Uh, oops. Uh, let's undock. There we go. Alright. Now let's for real, for real, see if there's a back way. Skylarka found an ad. <laughs> oh, well, thank you, Skylarka, for the resub. I very much appreciate it. And especially with Prime. Very nice of you. Uh oh. What is this? He still refuses to take me aboard when he is working. He is convinced that I will find it dull, or that the crew will be crass or otherwise intolerable. Perhaps I am being overly needy. I know he needs time alone, but I'm so desperately bored at home when he is away. Recently installed some salvaging equipment onto the boat. I think the idea of pulling up treasure is terribly exciting. I must convince him to let me have a go. I see. I see. Oh, there is a back way. But... Wow, uh, that is quite an emblem. Okay. Uh, what's the fish here? Head home. Wait a minute. Is that what I think it is? <gasps> Conger eel. Conger eel. Now we just let it rot. What was that? Deliver that emblem. It's still considered fresh, huh? I just need to sleep for a few days.
You found it. I never thought I'd see this beauty again. But now I have a further favor to ask. Would you take this to my brother at Ingfell? Tell him his brother is sorry and would like to come home. This crest is yours. Gods, I haven't seen this since. So you did take it. I knew it. Your brother's sorry. Will you let him come home? I don't know if I was in a right state when he left. Okay, fine. You can stay in my old workshop. At least for the time being. But I need some time to clear it out. While I'm doing that, perhaps you can do something for me. We have been trying to clear some debris in the pathways through the cliffs to make a shortcut with explosives. I was able to say to charge, but the cliffs seemed particularly unsteady that day, so I didn't risk detonating it. You just need to get in there and set it off. Not far in. I left some yellow flags nearby. You can't miss it. <clears throat> oh, okay, I see. Alright, very nearly there. Hello, sir. Oh, God, come on. That's mean. Oh. A pile of loose debris. In the gaps between the rocks, you can see what appears to be a large white teeth. Yes. The debris crum crumbles away. You should let the whaler know. That's unfortunate. We've done it. We heard the blast from here. God's the echo. I am surprised the cliffs didn't come down on your head. Got things ready. Go and tell my brother that he can come home. Sweet. Hello again. Alright. Your brother forgives you. He's found a place for you to stay. He does? That's a huge weight off my chest. Once so old, I hardly remember why it was there. Right. Well, I'm packed and ready to go. Ah. You don't mind uh, being next to an eel, right? There we go, it's rotting now. We are good to go. Uh, 
The hermit notices the whaler standing on the dock waiting for him. Little brother, you're home. I'm so sorry, I was foolish. You both were. Come on inside. Let me get your bags. The two brothers walk away toward, down the dock. One of them pauses for a moment and turns back to you. Oh, stranger. If you find any more debris that needs clearing, I'm working on making some packed explosives. Come by the old whaling yards any time. At least they know where they are now. Okay. Let's uh, rest, and then I think that's where I'm going to be wrapping up. Thank you everybody for being here tonight. I uh, will be streaming tomorrow. Well, I won't be streaming. I'll be on Rekajiro's channel tomorrow uh, to play some Vault Hunters on the Minecraft server. So, uh, if you aren't already following Reku, please go do that. I'll be there tomorrow. But I'm going to raid out. Yes, let us raid out into Rat. We recently started streaming earlier. Well, not, you know, not brand new streaming, but started a stream a few minutes ago. So we're going to go raid out to Rat, and I hope you all have a good night.